Hey everybody, I'm Doug from Key Code Media. If you want to live stream with professional cameras to Facebook, YouTube, or any of those platforms, I have got the gadget that you need to have. Welcome back from that great intro we have. So I want to tell you a story and show you a piece of gear that I had in my bag the other day. Um, got a call from a friend, he's in a band, and of course, you know, when friends need something, they call the people that know what they're doing. I actually threw a bunch of gear in a, in a bag, truck my way down to Portland, kind of remote, away from the shop, so I couldn't run back and get cables, get anything else. But I had an encoder, monitors, uh, all kinds of gear that I brought with me to do the live stream. But I also brought something I hadn't used, but was kind of intrigued by, and it was this. It's the uh, Blackmagic Web Presenter. Now, I know what you might be thinking, Web Presenter, right? Hear me out. So we got down to the show, I'm setting everything up, I've got my encoder, and I, and I bust this out of the box, and I look at it, I'm like, you know what? I had some time, I wanted to give this a try. And basically what this box does, if you're not familiar, it takes any professional camera, or cameras, we'll get to that in a second, and turns them into a webcam. Now, before you go off and say webcam, yuck. It is 720p, so straight to Facebook, for example, it's going to look great. 720p is going to be fine for just about any live stream. Uh, this is not webcam quality. This just turns your inputs into something that the computer can see as a webcam. A couple key features you need to know about. No stream keys, no APIs. You don't have to sit there and try and enter those into an encoder and get it to connect and all that. The other great thing, was, especially at this gig, was the, uh, the client had somebody that was doing social media. So they could sit right at the laptop that we were feeding this into and do all their comments, chat with the, chat with the audience, you know, talk about the songs coming up, the, the show, everything. Now there's a couple quick connection things on your laptop you gotta worry about. Not a big worry, but just a couple boxes you have to check off before you can uh, get this connected. So we're gonna show you that right now, show you how easy this is to connect. We'll come back, look at the back plate, we'll talk about the rest of the features on this, and we'll take it from there. So this works on a Mac or PC, but same steps, kind of different ways to get there. I'll talk you through the Mac since that's what I have as my laptop. Uh, the first thing you want to do is launch pad it, system preferences, sound, and make sure you click on Blackmagic Web Presenter. This will automatically populate when you plug the USB cable into your laptop. So there we go. And then it's really this easy. On Facebook, for example, you're just going to click on live video. And it's accessing the camera, and suddenly there we are. There's our professional camera looking like a webcam. Now you look on the right-hand side of this page, and you'll see Blackmagic Web Presenter Video, default Blackmagic Audio. So we're all set up. It senses both, detects both, and go live. Three, two, one, and we're live on Facebook. It's that easy. So here we are on the back plane of the Blackmagic Web Presenter. Let's take a look. Power. Now normally you'd gloss over this, but I want to point out there's no wall wart for this. This is direct plug into the wall. So you can have the longest power cord in the world plugged into here. It's going to work great. You're not worrying about a little barrel connector or some odd transformer that's got to work for this. Direct power, great to have. Don't have to worry about having an extra plug in your gig box. Your USB connection, that's going to connect to the laptop, feeding the camera signal. And you've got three SDIs. You've got SDI in, SDI program out, and an SDI loop through. Now you've also got HDMI in as well. You've got HDMI in and a loop through out. The important thing for that is you can actually have two cameras connected to the Blackmagic Web Presenter, and you can cut between the two. It does a simple fade, and when we look at the front plane, you're going to see where we can do that. But key to note, have to be the same frame rate, same resolution for both cameras. If you're running 720p, 5994, you're going to have to run it on both cameras to make sure that this cuts cleanly and sees both cameras. You've also got some RCA inputs for balanced audio in, and you've got an XLR input for line and or mic input. So you can have uh, phantom power running out of this to power a mic if you want to go direct mic in, or a line feed off of a mixer if you're getting a mixer feed from somewhere. So let's take a look at the front and talk about what we see up there. So the Blackmagic Web Presenter, sold as is, does not come with this faceplate. I highly recommend, highly, highly recommend, get the faceplate. It's $85 retail. Believe me, 
it's a godsend when you're out in the field. Here's the reason. Your inputs. I can switch video inputs, audio inputs with the faceplate. And as we talked about on the back plane, you have your two sources for cameras. This is where you can switch between the two, hitting one and two. You can set this up so there's a nice little fade between the two. So if you have, uh, I don't know, a laptop, for example, you want to do a presentation, cut to a camera, maybe two cameras, you can actually do some simple cuts between the two. Over here, you can see we have the picture that we're getting from the camera. So you're seeing your signal and you're also seeing audio metering, which is great. So again, faceplate, please get it. $495 for this thing and $85 bucks for the faceplate. It's a great deal, great bargain. I recommend everybody grabbing one, especially if you're doing live streaming because you just never know. It could be a single camera podcast. You might be doing an entire table. You could be doing an entire convention. There could be 3,000 people, a bunch of cameras. You can take that master out off the switcher straight into this, right into Facebook, right into YouTube, OBS, Twitch, whatever you're using. Broadcast quality cameras, broadcast quality audio, live streaming, very, very simple. We highly recommend it. Thanks for joining us, and now you know enough to be dangerous. So if you saw our first video, uh, we told you if we got 100 likes, our boss would buy us a new backdrop. We didn't quite get 100 likes and our boss wasn't paying attention. So Mike Cavanaugh, thanks for buying this stuff for us. It's gonna show up on James's credit card. Um, yeah, we built a new set. And by the way, practical sets, I know, I know virtual sets, everybody's hot into it, but I'm gonna tell you, I honestly don't think there's anything better than having a practical set behind it. Thanks everybody.